Hey guys, this is developer dude and in the previous video we have designed this section but this is not working. These buttons are not working without JavaScript. So in this video we will create a JavaScript file. So let's get started. So here we will create a new file. Save it as app.js. Okay. Now link it, link it here down. Script app dot slash app dot yes, okay. Control save. Now write code here. So I'm just close close this section. And so here I will write the JavaScript code. So first to target the left button, which first target the right button. So Query target in the right button, so right document dot query selector dot r button dot r button dot add event listener click and the function click and the function is function cut this parameter event okay event and uh, now in this event i will the document dot query selector query selector and select the product slide product slide and uh, in this product slide the function will work Mm, product slide dot so we are going to scroll it so scroll left scroll left plus it's equal to one one zero zero okay now event dot prevent default okay now save it wait I think something is missing no, everything is fine so just save it and let's head out here so this is our project okay so nothing is here okay now click on this button it's not scrolling open the console log when we are clicking on it Click. Let's change the file name. Wait, rename it. Create another JavaScript file. Control N. Control Shift S. And apps dot yes. Change the name here. Apps dot yes. Okay. Control Save. Now write the code here. I copied that code, paste here, save, now check out. It's still not working. Right there. Add event listener, click. Product slider, everything is fine. After clicking on this. Console.log. Done. means the file is not connected. Write the code again. So const left button left button equal to document dot query selector L button control C control V okay change it to R button const now write the write button dot add event listener and 
click function function write your event and now control button now create another const name with consent is equal to comment current is equal to document dot query selector dot product slide and here conan dot scroll left scroll left plus is equal to one one double dot zero event dot prevent default okay control save now check this out okay now it's working now paste it control c and paste it here and change this to left and same function just change it minus control save control refresh Okay, so both of these buttons are working perfectly. So here's the JavaScript code. So in this site, another section, same as it is the above. So just what will we do? Just copy and paste it again. So wrap it, Control C and Control V. Okay, now add uh, another class with it. So left button with class name is to be button one b and control c down there control v and change it to a we are changing this we are adding some classes here so now add a product slide one control save now because we did this because now we have copy and pasted this section just refresh it so when we press on these button it's not working because we have changed the classes so just do so here it is just copy and paste and change the class name to button 1b for the left to right 1b for the left okay So now we just change the image source. So change this image source. Just change these sources. Just check this out. Control R. Okay. So here it is. Now it's working. In the next video, we'll create this.